I think I was born to be a stormtrooper. Wow. But what if, what? What if it could be a noble occupation, working for the Empire and whatnot? I bet they had a horrible severance package, though. Well, that's probably true. Because you're a clone. Right, right. Well, but, but what else do you do after a stormtrooper, you know? They had to have pretty good life insurance, I suppose. Yeah, well, you know, they'd, they'd go home to a family other than stormtroopers, you know? True. Probably wasn't a stormtrooper's union or nothing. You think they were mailed their paychecks? Maybe it was a great deposit. <laughs> Maybe some kind of squatter deal. You know, you live in our guest house. <laughs> but like how the coal miners used to live, the company store and all that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, you know, like, but you, you know, Lucas almost always has a beard. Well, if you call that a beard, but it's, it's probably hiding his scar. Well, from what? Didn't he used to race cars? Well, I think so. Was that Lucas? I, I thought you were going to say something else. That he lost a lightsaber duel. Yeah, but he wouldn't have he wouldn't have lost if he were scarred, right? True. But then again, who flies face first into a lightsaber duel? Well, a lot of Jedi. Sith, also. Don't forget the Sith. Well, it doesn't matter anyway. Why is that? Well, Lucas came up with the whole concept of lightsabers. You know, what would he be the master? Not necessarily. Alright, I, I I see your point. Besides, he he more than likely has carpal tunnel. From or No no typing nerf herder. Kudos on that observation. In closing, Lucas never shaves because he's too busy writing and... And? Yeah, what? No. Lucas wrote the entire Star Wars epic, the entire notion of lightsabers. Sith and Jedi and all lead up to one definitive moot point. Vis-a-vis. Vis-a-vis. There is no Stormtrooper severance package. You're dead to me now.